Chernobyl is still producing nuclear reactions which are steadily growing inside the rubble of the disastrous power plant, which has scientists concerned another disaster could be on the cards. Scientists monitoring the defunct Chernobyl nuclear power plant in Ukraine have been shocked to see a spike in nuclear reactions over the past five years. Fission reactions have been erupting deep in an inaccessible chamber which has left some concern that another explosion could be on the cards. Nuclear fission is a reaction caused by radioactive decay. Since the fateful explosion in 1986, which killed 31 people, radioactive decay has been taking place. However, scientists from Ukraine have noted a spike in nuclear fission over the past five years leading to fears there could be another explosion. Anatoly Idorosenko, of the Institute for Safety Problems of Nuclear Power Plants, ISPMP, in Kiev reported a 40% rise in neutron emissions since 2016. Mr. Doris Henko and his colleagues are now analyzing the smoldering uranium fuel which is coming from the chamber, known as Subreactor Room 305 halves, to see if it will stabilize on its own. If not, a daring intervention may have to be on the cards. Maxim Savili F., also of the ISPMP, told Science Magazine, We have only assumptions. There are many uncertainties, but we can't rule out the possibility of an accident. One possible option could be to send robots into the entombed chamber to install boron cylinders. These could help to control the nuclear waste by mopping up neutrons. The team are unsure why there has been a spike, but it could be due to a shelter which was placed over the chamber in 2016. The new structure, which replaced one hastily erected by the Soviet Union in the wake of the disaster, might not allow rainwater through like its predecessor did. Rainwater may have helped to cool down the chamber and mop up nuclear fission. Without the rainwater, there is likely nothing cooling the neutrons inside down. Neil Hyatt of the University of Sheffield, an expert in nuclear waste disposal, said the situation is akin to embers in a barbecue pit. He added, it's a reminder to us that it's not a problem solved, it's a problem stabilized. We're talking about very low rates of fission, so it's not like a fizzing nuclear reactor. And our estimation of fissile material in that room means that we can be fairly confident that you're not going to get such rapid release of nuclear energy that you have an explosion. But we don't know for sure. We have seen excursions like this before with other fuel debris. The neutron base rate has increased, stabilized and decreased again. That's obviously what we hope might happen.